Hey everybody, this is Don over at Johnny's Used Cars. Today I'm showing this 2005 Nissan Fair Lady Z that just came in. Uh, pretty difficult to find because there's that many out there. It's got 95,000 kilometers on it, which is about uh, 59,000 miles. Uh, before we get started, I'd like to let you know that we do have on a lot discounts. So the price you see on the website will not be the final price when you get here, okay? Uh, so definitely stop on by. So before you take a look around and show you the features inside, I'd like to ask you to please watch the video until the end. I do go over a lot of information in my videos, going to answer a lot of your questions. So things like the JCI, the warranty, the road tax, I cover all that and more. So please bear with me until the end. You'll have all the answers. If not, go in and contact me or stop on by. This Fair Lady Z is a um, ST version, by the way, but it is a two-passenger vehicle in the 300 series category, so the larger category. Road tax per year is going to be uh, 19,000 yen, which is about 170 or about 160 bucks right now with the current exchange rate. Road tax is due every April May time frame, so we'll take every for you this year. You won't have to worry about it till next. Now you do have two options to pay for it, the first one being US dollars cash outright, which could get you a larger discount, or you can take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months. Now this one, yes we don't have a down payment requirement, but for this one we will require something down and we'll work with you uh, on a case by case basis, okay? Um, so let's go ahead and take a look inside. This does not have the um, traditional uh, rain guards or anything, but uh, part of the SE version, just before I forget, it does come with the Brembo brake system, okay? So that's a, a big bonus. So let's take a look inside. This beautiful orange leather. This thing's really nice shape, okay? Like I said, it's just coming in. It hasn't been detailed yet, so let's get this baby started. So it's gonna be a little dirty. All right, let me squeeze this in. Yeah, I'm not sure if we're gonna get it all the way in there, but 94,877 on the odometer. Showed a couple of warning lights here. Uh, that one on the uh, top left, uh, obviously your seatbelt one. Make sure you wear your seatbelts. They do give tickets on and off base. Then the one at the bottom of that, that circular one, is your emergency brake. Um, hopefully you can still see that. Uh, it's not a low pressure tire gauge, but it is a hand brake. So when you disengage, it goes away. The gauge, it comes right back on. Other than that, it's a very simple, straightforward, straight ahead instrument cluster. Everything pops up on a dash while you're driving. Please pull over, find out what it is, take the necessary action. Off to the left here, you have a couple meters. Um, you have your monitor here. What is going on? This does have a back camera. I don't know why this ETC thing is popping up. Hold on a second. I'm not sure why that's happening because it didn't happen before I... It, it has a back camera, okay? And then it's missing a radio that's in here that, uh, again, it just came in. We're gonna have to put that in there. And then you do have this little tray right here. I'm not sure what you're gonna use that for. And then a little power outlet down there, okay? And then you have a cup holder on each door panel. Then that is your passenger space over there. You got your red road flare hanging out. And then this is the space I have on my side. I am 5'11", as everybody loves knowing. The seat is all the way back, all the way down. Uh, uncomfortable right where I am. Now I'm gonna give this one more try because I saw that ETC thing go off. And bam, there you go. So I'm not sure if, it's the, if, if this has the ETC intertwined in it and it has to wait until that loads, but there's your back camera, okay? And then, um, you got your shifter. I think I, I went a little off course there, but your shifter, your brake, uh, your hand brakes I told you about, and then a little uh, cup holder slash storage right here as well. This does have heated seats and a little compartment back here for some storage. And then back here, a little bit of storage, and behind the uh, passenger seat, more storage, okay? And another power outlet right behind you. All right, let's go. Oh, it does have a sunglass compartment up here. Let's go eye level. That's my eye level right there. Can't see anything past the windshield wipers, like always. Go all the way back. Now, normally this is the time I show you the auction sheet showing you that this is a non-accident vehicle from mainland Japan. Keep that in mind, non-accident. Many dealers can't say that. We can. Okay, so, uh, but I, I keep those inside until it's been detailed. Once it's been detailed, it's gonna go up here on the sun visor on the driver's side so you can see for yourself. Uh, before I show you the trunk area, let me show you a couple other things. Uh, you do have your mirror, mirror controls, your uh, door locks, and your um, window controls all on the door panel here. This is that little ETC I was talking about. It's electronic toll collector. It works like Easy Pass in the States if you're able to get the card for it for the expressway here. And then right underneath that, hopefully you're getting that, I really can't see. On the right side here, you do have your gas cover release, and then you have your hood release. Okay? So I'm hoping that you saw that, because I got a really bad glare. Let's go to the back. Yeah, really, really great shape. Very clean uh, 
vehicle. So this one I'm gonna have to try to do. Oh, there, there you go. All right. It is a sports car, so you don't buy a sports car for the space, but it actually has pretty decent space, okay? All right, it does have the wing. So let's go to the uh, engine compartment. They're gonna wrap this video up. All right, and there you have it. This is a 3.5 liter V6, okay? Which will be clean during the detailing process. So there you have it, 2005 Nissan Fairlady Z, which will not last long. This is the ST version, okay? Um, what I say, almost 95,000 kilometers on it, which is about 59,000 miles. Military price goes down to, I forget, 7,900. With an additional military discount, we'll get it down to 7,700. Again, while you're here, please ask the information guy about on the lot discounts and we'll get you a lower price, okay? Uh, but for now, the 7,700 is gonna include a two year JCI, the one year bumper to bumper warranty, the 2022 road tax and a 10% sales tax is already included. Only thing on top is going to be the American insurance requirement, whether you're going liability or full coverage, which is totally up to you, and you can get uh, we can assist you with that here. And this will be sports car insurance. It's one and a half times the norm, okay? Um, but get, uh, touching on the warranty, I know there are places with two-year warranties. If you're going to base your uh, de uh, decision solely on the two-year mark, you definitely need to come out and talk to us, and we'll explain why, okay? But for now, uh, we do uh, encourage you to shop around, go out to the dealers, see what they have. But definitely stop by Johnny's Used Cars. Let us show what we have and what our program is all about and how it can assist you. We are definitely making a difference because we are different. Stop on by, we'll show you why, just like many others. Don't forget, two ways to pay for it, U.S. dollars cash outright, or take advantage of 0% financing for 24 months, okay? So thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.